Oh. That was intense. So, my New York vlog hasn't uploaded yet. Our Wi Fi is not that great at the apartment. And I haven't had time to go sit at a coffee shop. Also, if you're sticking around for the last five laps on my Instagram for the live feed last night, my phone died. And unfortunately, our team teammate, Caesar, who won the mission crit last Saturday, was making some moves up at the front of the race so that he could try to bridge to the two guys in a break. And I remember the last time I seen him, he just was just holding his ground and like moved up to the front of the race and just shortly after two turns suffered a tragic like gnarly crash not tragic but like it was a really crazy crash he got to the front of the race and uh, he ran into the one of the guardrails and it impaled him in his chest so we went to the hospital to take his information and they wouldn't let us see him, so I don't really know what's going on, but they said that he was like better. Um, our manager stayed with him, Kevin did, and uh, hopefully we're going to go see him here in the next hour or two. So um, all the videos and stuff are on hold at the moment, but it's beautiful out here in Brooklyn. I just went to the Lululemon store and got this like reflective, the Surge runner's bag I've been wanting to get for so long super grateful to be able to get it and this one isn't all black it's like reflective so when your light hits it it just lights up i'll show you guys later when i get home i'll do a little video and show you guys the little features but uh just walking back to the place now it's like a five mile walk total pretty nice it's great to get to see the city by feet um yeah we got about 20 miles in last night total after the race i'd say no Strava though, so I guess it didn't happen. But uh, yeah, just to give you guys a little quick update. And uh, you guys have a wonderful day. And I'll see you tomorrow morning at the airport.